We do have breaking news. It was pretty tense. A scene outside the Spartanburg County Public Library today. A state senator was there raising concerns about the content of certain books. He was met with protesters. 7 News reporter Chloe Salsameda was there and has all the details. State Senator Josh Kimbrell is calling for certain books to be removed from the children's section at the Spartanburg County Public Libraries. He says they're inappropriate for kids. That's inappropriate. While holding a children's book that discusses gender, State Senator Josh Kimbrell demanded action from the Spartanburg County Public Libraries. Senator Kimbrell is calling for the library to remove books about sexual acts, as well as gender and sexual identity from the children's section claiming they're inappropriate and too graphic for kids. The library says when books come in, staff reviews them and decides how books should be categorized. So we will not allow tax money to be used to indoctrinate children in this state without their parents knowing about it. Right across the street, people were protesting his message. If you don't want to read a book, don't read it. And if you don't want your kids to read a book, you know, don't let them check it out. I mean, if the books aren't removed, Senator Kimbrell is demanding that the head of the library resign. He's also threatening to propose an amendment to cut the salaries of library executives and pull funding from each of the county's libraries. Todd Stevens is the county librarian. I would suggest that it would benefit everyone if Senator Kimbrell would like to sit down and have a conversation about what his concerns are. Stephen says his library staff does its best to buy books that are appropriate and to place them in the correct section. And he says they depend on people to let them know if they feel that certain books are inappropriate or in the wrong section. My thinking is that when somebody expresses a concern, they at least deserve the opportunity to have their concern heard. The library says it has these forms available. Anyone can fill them out and you can state your concerns about certain books and the library staff will evaluate each form. In Spartanburg, Chloe Salsameda, 7 News. The library tells us it has had to remove books each year to make room for new books and it takes the public's concerns seriously.